All right, welcome back. Looks like the audio was good in that last episode, so we will just be continuing right where we left off. More Starly. I mean, I don't want to just catch a million Starly forever. Um, I guess we can... Where were key items? Here. I mean, I have a lot of materials. I don't see why I wouldn't just craft a whole bunch. I guess I was just getting unlucky earlier. I missed. No. Oh my gosh. Ooh, Ponyta. Oh, you didn't like that. They run right when I decide to throw. Okay, I think we can fight this Ponyta. Wait, that's not a... Yeah, that's not a Rapidash. I didn't think Ponyta had fire on, on their back. It's keeping its guard up. Ran away, no! How do I stop it from running away? I got this while I'm here. Is this one like darker? Ah, uh, ran away. I wanted to fight it. to this. No, not you. Badoof, get out of the way. Get out. Stop it. No. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I I'll fight. Come back. Yeah. It's <laughs> it ran in the water. Uh, Got to work on the AI a little bit there. That is not realistic. Okay, we can just fight in the river. Okay. Wow, that did a lot of damage. <laughs> Atrohot is almost underwater. Okay, perfect. No. No! This is so difficult. I mean, I do have to say, as bland as this entire area is, it is kind of cool to actually interact with Pokemon in the wild. 
I, I'm saying that very begru begrudgingly. What is that? Oh, Badoof. Okay, Ponyta. Let me read these berries again. Draw attention. Draw attention. Hitting a Pokemon with one may stun it. I mean... Now, does that mean it makes it easier to catch? Or it just lets me engage in battle? I'll try it if it makes it easier. Oh, see, that one's very catchable. Maybe I should just throw a Pokeball. Nice. So how can I add Ponyta to my team? Uh, do I have to go back to the professor first? I guess that would make sense. Let's grab. Oh, okay. More Bidoofs. Don't really care. I mean, I guess I should. It's kind of the whole point of the game. That's a Rapidash with the red eyes. Yeah, I'll fight you. Uh, what is that? Oh god, what a level 40! <laughs> Run flutter! Oh my god! He's dead. He just died. <laughs> uh okay. I I went out. Yes, I want to run away. I thought it might be like level 10 or something. Oh, and it's just gonna follow me? How long does this go on? Uh oh. I don't know what that is. Pokeball, go! Does it just deflect him? Yeah, okay. So, what do I do here? Just run away? What is this? Oh god! Can't catch me in the water. Can I hide? Okay, it's not even spawned in the world now. How can it see me? Um... Is it really following me? No, it's not. So why does it... Say I'm in danger. Can I revive? I don't... Yeah, it won't have any effect. Well, sorry, Flutter. Took one for the team.
okay, the rapid ash of death finally let me go. Oh yeah, what was that thing I picked up? This. Material for crafting items that can restore vitality. Hey, there you go. That's just what I need. Shiny rock. Um, horseshoe planes. <laughs> uh, I think I should probably start wrapping this up since I have a man down and want to reorganize my team a little bit. So I'll just do what I can out here and kind of circle my way back. Oh, this thing. Accept your challenge. What is Eleanor? Oh, the strong style. Alright. Wait, what'd that say? Strong sunlight, the speed of grass type Pokemon is boosted. Oh, so they're like environmental. Oh, here's the action order. Why is that off by default? So I can go... Agile... Or strong. But this way I can go twice in a row. That's a lot of damage. That does a lot more damage than it would in a normal Pokemon game. Nice. Catch. Large. Defeated. So I guess it doesn't really matter. Wee! I can run around on the battlefield. <laughs> Looks like it turns into a, a plant. I hope there's eventually I can interact with Pokemon in the water here, like with a fishing rod or something. What is that? Oh, just a Starly. Yeah, I think there is a day night cycle. Definitely seems like sunset. That was a, a fail of a throw. Here, no. I want to know about this one. If he's easier to catch. Whatever. Good for you. Uh, just 
got really dark and now there's kind of spooky music playing. They're gonna be a ghastly or something. Oh, look! It's actually true, Drifloon. That's kind of cool. Nice. I, I have a Drifloon on the team. What does he evolve into? I can't, um... Oh, I know what he looks like. I can't remember. Uh, can I try again. Fight. Okay, that did a lot of damage. Uh, isn't bite good against or dark good against ghosts? Oh wait, only one kind of move can be strong or agile style. Interesting. Uh, I guess I'll catch this one too. No wild Pokemon will eat it. Um, there's Big Goof. I'll give him a chance to fight. Just slowly making my way back. on Drifloon. Catch. Caught at night. Defeated. Wow. I I mean, this just seems like a lot of work. I probably shouldn't send a Bidoof. Oh, was that Rapidash using Confusion earlier? Uh, I don't know if I have a good matchup against this guy. I mean, I guess I could heal Shanks. That's fine. Ooh, level six? Oh no. Why is it looking fast? Wait, what? Did he just use Thundershock or what? Why is he looking at me? Wait, what? He's fighting the other Shinx too? What? Can I change target? My attack? Yeah, Drifloon. Okay. Well, at least they're not attacking me. So what, they can just gang up on me? So I guess the the first Pokemon I encountered is the default one. Oh my gosh, the graphics there were the pop in. Okay, this is kind of weird. 
Um, strong quick attack? don't have to even battle a whole lot to train your Pokemon, it looks like. Now, is this going to let me glitch up this wall? I don't know why it does that. That's such a weird animation. What is this? No. More Drifloon. I don't need one right now. Hey, I'm back. Those are all the Pokemon I caught. Is that the limit to how many I can catch? Pokemon caught using a back strike? Oh, there you go. If you raise it to 10, it will be considered complete. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. Okay, because I was going to say, doing that, you know, catching 40 of each Pokemon is kind of insane. So, so Shinx is done, so I don't need to catch a million more. Motion slash cries. Okay. That's two forms. Okay. Um, how do I view one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, so those are the number of points? Is that it? Or no, that's the number. I don't know. Where where research level 8 comes from. So if you add up the points next to the check marks, that's 8. Then if you add up the number at the end of the line, it's 5 6 7 8 9. Starly is at 7. If you add up the numbers there, it's 9. And then the other number is 8. So where does 7 come from? Hmm.
but at least 10 points isn't difficult to do. Okay, maybe now I'll start talking to the... Well, that's kind of cool. Hmm. Uh, well, when I get a more fleshed out team, I'll do that. So you probably saw clothes. Is this my room? <laughs> Look, you, you take your sandals off when you walk on the floor. Very Japanese. Um, I guess I don't need... Some of this stuff. I don't know, can I put this? Guess I can sell the stardust. Nope, not paying for hairstyling hats are for. Ooh, or revive. What, um... How do I get new recipes? Like, can I... I want to craft or revive. Recipe for crafting remedies from scratch. Remedy? Honey cake? Ox guard? Uh, sure, I'll try this. I thought that might be a revive, or like a bad revive, but alas it is not. Ooh, dragon Pokemon. They will gather where one is thrown. I almost just want to buy one of those. Eh, I'll wait be a while before we see dragon Pokemon. Five second load time every time you have to enter a room. Wait, 
Wait, what'd that say? Oh. Oh, you can put pins in that. Well, nothing here. Creepy looking. Hmm. Is this a mechanic? Huh. Good health. Escape the effects of status conditions inflicted by wild. Um, stay in good health, I guess. Is this like permanent? Sure, I'll try it. Or do I have to buy one each time it would prevent something? This building? Seems like an important building. Sure, apricorn harvest. Hopefully that wasn't a scam. Like a human lamp post or something. Oh, this is going to take a while to go through all these <sighs> houses. She's from Hoenn. Gen 3 represent. This is probably a waste of time, but I have also learned my lesson from playing many of Pokemon games. You never know when just a random townsperson will be like, oh, here's TM Psychic. It's like the best move in the whole game. 
why was I tired there? I kind of like this background music. Almost there. Just a necessary evil of these kinds of games. Yoshi. I think I might have messed up my system talking to that. Yeah, we did this one. So we go up here now. See, I got some good info there. Have you seen a Machop? Okay, well that was kind of a waste of time, but never have to do it again. Talk to this person over here. Oh, cool. Hey, this is good to know. Um, how do I? So like this guy, yeah, move, change out with the one pony to I have. And I want to change out, I guess, which Starly is better. Wait, they have different... Oh. They just have 
Aerial Ace. Um, I guess switch this one out with this Drifloon. And switch out... Or no, wait. Shanks Drifloon. Um, honestly, I think I would rather have... What does Wurmple evolve into? Um, is Wurmple the Silcoon, um, Beautifly? Because if it's Beautifly, that's actually a pretty decent Pokemon. Uh, sorry, Big Goof. What's the best Wurmple I got? Three, two... Six. Okay. Keep Flutter, Drifloon. Okay, this seems like a pretty good team. And then, I guess, is there a downside to putting all these in pasture? Or wait, they're already in pasture. Can I see them? Aw. That'd be really cool if you could just see them there. Okay, so this replaces the PC box, which I guess makes sense because they don't have technology here. Oh, there's different kinds of... Oh, that's good. Um, so do I have any names for these guys is the question. Uh... How, okay, how about... Pop. I haven't thought of anything. Ponyta. Hold on, will this even fit? Yeah, it should fit. Lava Biscuit. Uh, Wurmple, assuming it's Beautifly. Um. Hmm. Shanks. I feel like there should be a pretty obvious name for Shanks. Uh, I'll think of one later. Yes, that is a good question. I would like to know that as well. Now, I'm going to be really upset if I go to this guy, or girl, or whatever, and then as part of the tutorial, they take me around the whole village and show me how to do all this stuff I just discovered. I bet that's what's going to happen. Heavy balls. So this is in place of gym badges.
Oh, so they also just give you some recipes. Oh, there you go. Revive. Oh, that's what that Vivichoke was. I should probably go pick that up again. in the back. Yep, figured all that out. Yeah, didn't I... Um, complete those missions? Catch a Wormhole to give to Beauregard. Where was... That person. It was just like along here, wasn't it? Is it this guy? Yeah. Oh, give you? Sure, take the level two. Yep, beautifully. Obviously, Eugene. I think I actually completed the Starly Pokedex entry, did I? I did not, so. Can't do that quest. Uh, meet girl at training ground. Um, I guess see if Drifloon or Pop can do anything. Kari, I gotta remember her name.
Wait, does she have six? Oh, she has one Pokemon. I was gonna say. Dang. Oh, that's not good. So I can't do any of the... Hey, whoa, 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 he's moving up. Yes. Hypnosis. Gosh dang it. Oh, this is bad. Really? Oh boy. Okay. I see you. Actually, it's kind of bad, because I my strongest Pokemon is probably Flutter, who's weak. Yeah, and Starly's weak. <laughs> um, maybe Wumple can poison him? Haha! <laughs> Um, can I switch Pokemon? Yeah, so I wanted to get experience. Now I can just battle of attrition here. This is actually, uh, kinda neat. Like, this is an actual Pokemon battle that I'm watching happening. Watching happen. Uh, yeah, just agile, quick attack, and you should be done. Master a move to get the strong and agile style. Whoa, they just give you the chart. Figured that out. Oh, so Agile Style does reduce the power, uses more PP, boosts the power, lo lowers speed. Uses more PP. Sure, I'll need some moves. Sure, new moves. Oh, interesting. Wow, these are some interesting moves you can get early on. Rock Smash. Aerial Ace on a water Pokemon? 
Hmm. False swipe doesn't, I don't know, doesn't seem super useful yet. Uh, these are nice, but some of them are a little expensive. Oh, wow, ominous win. That's a good move. Hmm, I don't know if I want to spend half of my money. Okay, that's good. Wow. Baby doll eyes? Oh, yeah. I mean... Ice Fang for 500 seems... Mm -hmm. Okay, Ominous went on Drifloom, though. That, that seems kind of worth it. Can Warple learn anything? Nothing. Hmm. Ominous win for a thousand. Yeah, I don't really care about these. Because that, that would get same type attack bonus. Calm Mind is also pretty good. Uh... Sure, I'll take a little bit of a gamble. Learn Ominous Win. That's pretty cool. Uh, I went to Master Moves. Need a Seat of Mastery. Okay, so that's what that item is for. So getting ten of those will get you one of these items. Yes, effort levels. Interesting. So there are some changes to the combat. It's actually a little nice. Um, I think I might actually call this episode for here, seeing after this cutscene, so that we'll be ready to head out on the next expedition, next episode. Okay, so that's what that was in the Pokedex entry. Mushroom recipe. Are you Link? <laughs> Scrounge not from the forges of thy fellows. What does Activate Guide do? Uh-oh. I don't know what that did.
Krikatot. That's like the little bug Pokemon. Oh, did that just put the waypoint over his head? Yeah, that's what that did. Okay, that's good to know. Uh, everyone's at full health, right? Yeah, no, I should probably... Oh, so I do have a few honey. So can I craft a... Whoop, no, I want to use work then. A revive. I can. I shall craft one. Uh... And I don't have any of those mushrooms, do I? Springy mushroom? Guess I'm not sure what I should... I guess I don't need this in my satchel. Probably enough storage. Um, do I need to talk to you for anything? Continue. Okay. Well, I think I'm ready to set out on the next expedition. So I will end the episode here and see you next time.